What's up, everyone? This is Saint Sonic 91. In fact, holy crap! Volume overload. Jesus. Anyway, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Silver. Last, in the last episode, we took care of the Elite Four, and now we're gonna be taking down the champion. Just doing a little last-minute healing and dealing. Waking. Quickie's probably not going to be used that much in this one, considering that pretty much all of them are flying types. I think Swoop's going to be used the most, because he's the only one with, with an Ice-type move. So, we'll start off with him. And second thought, I'll stick Static in the front. Without further ado, let's do this thing! It's on like Donkey Kong. Been waiting for you. Eric, knew that with you, with your skills, you eventually reach me here. There's no need for words now. You'll battle to determine who is the stronger of the two of us. It's the most powerful trainer, Pokemon League champion. I, Lance, the Dragon Master, accept your challenge. This is it, the final battle with Champion Lance. Lance's Pokemon all are part flying. So that's a tremendous weakness right there. And he only has about four different Pokemon, the rest of the, the other two being the exact same. Seems that Lance doesn't believe in variety. Alright, who's he bringing up next? Dragonite? You'd think he'd be saving those for the end. Pretty much the only thing that will affect Dragonite is either a Dragon type Pokemon or an Ice type. And the only thing that I've got is Swoop with a Nice Punch. You'd think he'd be saving the level 50 for the end. An Outrage is crazy strong. But it's unstoppable. Once you move, once you use it, you have to stick with it until you become confused and you have to re fix that and everything. Not a whole lot to say here. It's just that dragons are insanely weak to ice types and very, very resistant to everything else. Oh, that's probably gonna kill me. Uh huh. Jackass. They're sending someone else. Heat wave, you're up. Stop just in time. Alright, who's next? Aerodactyl. I'll keep Heat wave in there because I need to revive my guy. Aerodactyl's not going to be that hard to get rid of. Wake up, Swoop. You got work to do. I think he, I think he still has like one more Dragon Knight left. Crap! 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 No! 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 Damn. This might be a bad move, but I don't care. Nope, it's not a bad move. And all those guys know Hyper Beam, which pretty much they'll all. Um, it's pretty powerful, but apparently not against my guys. But they'll have to recharge. They'll have to wait a turn before they can react. It's a good thing that Aerodactyl is part flying, because Static will be good against it. It's also part rock. I guess this was a good choice. I thought I thought Steel was bad against Rock, but apparently not. Alright, who you got left? Level up. Dragonite. 
Dragon against my gator. All the times I've played this on, like, my old Game Boy, he's always saved his strongest for last. I don't know why he's doing... I don't know why he's not doing it here. Ooh, you bitch. This is gonna hurt a bit. But it's gonna hurt you more. Alright, the final Pokemon is Charizard. And to give her a little bit of screen time, might as well send in Luna Shard. It really doesn't matter at this point. taking longer than needs to be. Quick attack. And that ends it. Well done indeed. Champion Lance was defeated. It's over. But it's not feeling. I'm not angry that I lost. In fact, I feel happy. Maybe that I witnessed the rise of a great new champion. Five dollars in moonies! Phew! You have become truly powerful, Eric. Pokemon have responded to your strong and upstanding nature. As a trainer, you will continue to grow strong with your Pokemon. Oh god. It's all over. <laughs> if you weren't so slow. Ah, oh, Eric. It's been a long while. You certainly look more mature. Conquest of the League is just fantastic. Dedication, trust, and love for your Pokemon has made this happen. We are outstanding, too, because they believed in you as a trainer. They pers persevered. Congratulations, Eric. Let's interview the brand new champion. This is getting to be a bit new, I see. You come with me? Yeah, I don't want to hear her bitching it anyway. <laughs> This is kind of a bitchin' looking room. It's a long time since I last came in here. It's where we honor the League of Champions for all eternity. The courageous Pokemon are also inducted. Here today we witnessed the rise of a new League Champion. A trainer who feels compassion for and trust in this Pokemon. A trainer who succeeded through perseverance and determination. New League Champion who has all the makings of greatness. Allow me to register you and your partners as champions. Feel free all you want, dude. And with that out of the way, we have finally beaten. Defeated the Elite Four and became the new champion of the Ignigo Plateau and of the world. But this does not mean that the LP is over. Oh no! Not by a long shot. Because we have a whole nother region to explore. Well, mainly I'm just going to be going against all the gym layers and plus the final, the real final battle. Nothing, nothing will change that much. 
I don't care about my rating and my Pokédex. I don't care much for catching them, I just want to raise a powerful team. Oh god. It's been so long since I've been through this. One Pokémon game, and into another. Thank God I don't want to go through another one. Yeah, after the after Silver, I'm not I'm not gonna be doing another Pokemon game. They're all the, they're pretty much all the same. Very subtle differences. I mean, sure, there's different kinds of Pokemon, but really, they're basically all the same. And that's the end of the credits. That's the end for now, everyone. See you all next time. We explore the Kanto region. See you guys then.